Why, hello there, young trainer. You look quite fatigued. Why don't you take a little rest here? No? You want to look for slow pokes? Let me tell you. Those slow pokes are quite aggressive nowadays. Ever since those rocket falls came bumbling along. Here, take a drink of water while I tell you how dangerous those Pokemon are. Many slow pokes lived in that beautiful grassland, all happy, content with the lazy life they had, until a group of men clad in black came along, obsessed with their tails. Chop, they took a tail. Chop, they took another tail. The men stole tail after tail, leaving the slow pokes groaning in agony while they took their tails. Some slow pokes died from the sheer pain of the tail being forcefully taken. However, the rest that lived bore a strong hatred towards the ones that took their tails. Slowly, they began to grow fierce and even more untamed. The men still came, able to snatch a few tails every now and then. Until one day, one of the slow pokes managed to strike one of the wicked men. The slow poke forced the man on the ground then tried to look for his own tail. Unfortunately, there was no sign of his tail. The slowpoke, being an average dim-witted slowpoke, simply ripped the man's arm off, substituting the arm as his tail. The arm worked well for a tail, and the slowpoke began to spread the news about the new way to get tails. The slowpokes with missing tails pounced on every person that was clad in black, believing it to be their enemy. They would rip off their arms and legs and strut off with them. Then why, you'd probably be thinking, do you not see any slowpokes with arms or legs as tails? That's simple. The slowpokes love to swim, you see. They would go straight into the water after they've acquired their new tail, and test out its capabilities. That's when the shelders strike. You do know that, according to theory, a shelder clamps itself onto a slowpoke's tail and a slowpoke would evolve in slow bro. Well, that's exactly what happened. The Shelders loved the taste of human meat so much, they would do anything to stay there forever. Of course, the slow bros didn't mind, but the Shelder gives it strength. Once, a trainer accidentally cut off the arm from a slow bro. The Pokemon was so enraged, I tell you, it snarled and hissed and his power manifested greatly. The trainer was immediately killed. His arm ripped off for compensation. The shelter then clamped back onto the new arm. Slow pokes aren't meant to be trifled with, trainer. If you want to fight with one head on, I hope you don't use your arms much. Thanks for sticking around to the end. And if you enjoyed today's story, make sure to leave a like. And if you want more like it, Make sure to subscribe and ring the bell so you never miss a story. If you need more now, why not check out my Pokepasta playlist? I'll leave that on this card, and I'll catch you in the next story.